Hey guys, I'm wearing the outfit my grandmother sewed for me, and guys, I'm enjoying it on me. Let me give you guys a hint. We're gonna be talking about those people that just started their journey of just bleaching. You guys know some of us here we done it, so it's not strange. I don't want you guys to say, oh, what did she say like that? I'm sorry if you feel offended by the way I said it, but it's bleaching, of course. If you are lighting up your skin, it's bleaching, okay? So, some of us, we are graduates, so I'm going to be talking about the new beginners, those ones that just started it. What this video is all about is telling you guys some of the things you should expect if you really want to go about the whole thing these are things i want you to expect i don't want you to be like why didn't anybody tell me about this before i started it i want to tell you so that when you watch this video you should say yeah treasure talks about it and it was my decision i took okay everybody has the right to do whatever they want to do but sometimes too you need somebody to break you up on what to expect in it okay you see, to make your skin fair, the first thing I will start with is very expensive. For those people that is dark, their trouble is not more than us. Our trouble is more. The money we spend on our skin is too much than the people that is dark. The reason why I said it is because, <clears throat> first of all, guys, my shower gel, I buy it for 20 US. My face cream. I buy it for five dollars. My body scrub, I bought it for twenty. Or I use on my skin, I bought it for ten dollars. Let's just say I have not finished buying all that I need yet. Those ones are just the few ones I was able to get to add to my skincare. But you guys know when it comes to fair pressing, putting all their skincares together, it's even more than that. The reason why you see I bought these ones is because that's the one I can afford. I don't think I can go extra mile. So we that already graduate into this whole bleaching thing, if you know the kind of money we are spent, it's too much. So I want you guys that are just starting this whole bleaching process to expect that your spending has not gone anywhere yet. You just started it. Because to be fair, is damn expensive than to be dark okay and then what i want you to expect is the pigmentation that one he she expected it me that sitting here well you guys see my skin looking all yummy if i tell you sometime when, I'm, when my skin ready to break out you will say this is no treasure that i can sit in front of the camera looking all sweet some, because sometimes, eh, let me tell you, sometimes when I see where I came from with this whole this whole bleaching thing, then I just see maybe one stupid cream just make my skin look bad. Guys, I can be too insecure. I, I, like, me going outside, I don't even want to do it because I feel very bad. Why did I fall for such a stupid cream that makes my skin look like that? I will be looking for cream everywhere, every corner that have good cream, just because I want my skin to go back to the way it was. It's not easy, oh. You guys should prepare yourself for that. You should prepare yourself for breakout. You should prepare yourself for agony. You should prepare yourself for dark spot. You should prepare yourself for this, oh, dark knuckles. That one, you will get it. Even if you say, I will buy the most expensive cream. Who told you that most expensive cream doesn't give you it? Do you know how many creams I have bought for this masking? I have bought cream that even worth 80 US. Who told you those cream didn't give me reaction? Those cream was the ones that gave me more reaction than the ones that they said 20, 30. Don't say, oh, I won't expect it because I will take care of my skin. I'm a beginner. No, you will expel it. Let me tell you, even if you exfoliate like five times a week, when the break are ready to come, it will come. Do you know I have extra soap that I bath with? Before I use my own skincare product. Because I feel say I'm killing gems from my skin before I use my product. But I still sometimes receive breakup. I still sometimes receive agony. I still sometimes receive uh, 
uh, pigmentation. You guys noticed one time I had pigmentation on my neck here. It takes me so long to get those things out. So that's it. That's some of the process. And then, if you want to be fair, you should prepare yourself mentally, physically, because if people that know you to be black and then you later make yourself fair, these ones are going to put their stinking mouth on you. Don't mind them or do what you want to do to make yourself happy. Like for me, I started lightening up my skin because I wasn't feeling so confident with my skin tone. I'm not saying dark skin is bad. Dark skin is the most beautiful skin color. I wasn't feeding myself, you know? So I felt I needed to spice up my skin too. And that's how I go into this whole lightening skin process. This skin, it, it deals with you mentally. Especially when your skin is going wrong the way you don't want it to. You should expect that. You are just getting into it. Secondly, hey! You will suffer for good cream. Hey! If I tell you guys how many creams I have used in this war, you wouldn't believe it guys i have used lots of cream to maintain this skin color i'm having now because in this whole lightening process you will never be pleased with one cream and the reason why you can't be pleased is because not all the cream goods sometimes you will plan on using that cream for one year you go low the cream will start giving you green veins, bad dark knuckles and then you will suffer from the dark knuckles after you suffer from it if you are using product it's not going to work dark knuckles is one of the stomach thing that comes from lightening skin so you should expect that too mm -hmm. one of the things you should expect again if you are dark skin you can go on your sun without worry but when you are fair you can't go on a sun like that without protecting that skin you are suffered to achieve that's the thing you should expect again mm -hmm. You should always get sunscreen with you. I'm telling you. And you should make sure and spend money to buy glow oil. And this skin here, it needs two type of cream. You need day and night cream. All these things, expect it. I mean, that's my experience. So if you guys have other experience to share with us, share in the comment section. Love you guys. See you guys in my next video. Bye-bye.